We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to the Freak Show. I'm your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today I get to take part in something that's pretty cool, but it's going to be a lot to do, a lot to handle, and I don't have a lot of time to get it done. So, we're going to dive in with both feet, and hopefully it all works out. Now, that being said, this intro is going to be a bit lengthy. I have a whole bunch of information I want to share with you guys, and it's all kind of important stuff. And take into account also right now, Atelier Ryza 2 released fairly recently, and I'm currently in the process of covering that. That's really my first true steps into the Atelier series. So this will probably be a backseated quite a bit, as are the other two games that are all releasing today. But I want to get that first episode out there, let you guys see that it's there, see what it's like, and kind of introduce you to them. So that's what these kind of first episodes are going to be, and then we'll come back to them and we'll play through. Like, I've been very impressed with the Atelier series thus far, and I'm looking forward to playing more. Again, lengthy intro, apologies, but here comes the info bomb. Before we start with that, a big shout out and a thank you to Koei Tecmo Games for hooking me up with not only the Atelier Sophie, the Alchemist of the Mysterious Book, DX, but the entire Atelier Mysterious Trilogy Deluxe Pack. So it's all three games, Atelier Sophie, the Alchemist of the Mysterious Book, Atelier Fearis, the Alchemist of the Mysterious Journey, and Atelier Liddy and Suell, I think, the Alchemist and the Mysterious Paintings. Now, information time, guys and gals. This is going to be available on this day, which is April 21st, 2021, on Switch, PlayStation 4, which, of course, will then be playable on the PlayStation 5 with backwards compatibility, and, of course, the PC or Steam version, which is what I'm going to be playing on this day. Now, this series apparently goes as far back as 1997, and the first five titles released only in Japan, which is interesting. Then a bunch of them came over to the West, and they released about a year after for the most part, and then it started getting to be like a couple of months apart with the latest games and so on and so forth. This is, I believe, the previous trilogy. There was these three games, then there was another Arland game, and then there was Rise of 1 and Rise of 2, and we're waiting on Rise of 3. So, what is different between this version, the DX version, and the original Atelier Sophie? Well, it is as follows. The original Atelier Sophie, the Alchemist of the Mysterious Book, released on June 7th, 2016 for the PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, Vita, and PC. And here's the new stuff in the DX version. Uh, new episodes of Sophie's Growth and a new costume. There's three new cauldrons. There's a sprinting option, which sounds like common sense, but hey, you know what? It's added. I'm eager to check it out and see what it's like, and I think that's going to be a lot of fun. There's a fast-forward feature for fast-paced battles. There's lots of the previously released DLC, and there's a photo mode. So I guess maybe Sophie is the only one that didn't have the sprint feature, and now they've added it. So pretty cool stuff. Anyway, guys, gals, I think that's pretty much everything. Let's dive in and actually get started here. Now, I've not. Okay, break time's over. I've not played uh, this at all. Like, I'm basically going in mostly. Bl I, I played the original uh, that I had on Steam very briefly. So, this is really going to be my first time because I know it's going to be a big time commitment. So, let, let's dive in and let's see what's up. And I love the fact that this has English voice acting, by the way. I'm super happy the first two in this trilogy has English voice acting. The third does not. Back to work. Nor does the Rise of Series, which I'm quite... Uh, it's so far my only complaint for uh, Rise of Two is there's no English voice acting. I'm just saying. That's a me thing. I know it doesn't matter to a lot of folks, so bear with me. All right, back to work. What's up, Sophie? I need to put in the puni ball and then add the uni after boiling it for a little while. Okay. Yeah, this is going well. Now I just have to mix it a little and... Huh? This is weird. What's with this color? Oh, it stinks! Oh, no, wait! Well, apparently that didn't go well. This is Kirchen Bell, a small town brimming with greenery and the sounds of church bells. Cool. A certain girl lives alone in this town. Oh. Her name is Sophie. Here, she runs an atelier, Whoa. using the alchemy she learned from her late grandmother. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's Atelier. An atelier? Really? Okay, well, um, yeah, we're going to still go with Atelier. I'm just saying. I, I, I've done some, some looking up, some research, and talking with some folks. 
Atelier seems to be the uh, uh, seems to be the go-to thing. So, the atel atelier. Hmm. It's interesting. Although she still has quite a lot of room for improvement. So I suppose it is the French pronun pronunciation. So eh, eh, anyway, I'll, I digress. Mm, messed up again. <sighs> At this rate, I'll never be as good as Grandma was. <sighs> Only there was a way to suddenly get really good at alchemy. Yeah, I feel that. Amazing medicine and stuff, and everyone in town would rely on me. <laughs> I wouldn't have any problems if that was the case. <sighs> Guess I should clean up. Oh yes, it's open. I don't smell none too good in there though. It's Monica Elmenreich. Hello, Sophie. What's that smell? Yeah. <laughs> I messed up again. More importantly, why are you here, Monica? Do you need something? Yes. There's something I'd like to ask of you. Huh. It's unusual for you to have a request. What do you need? Well, first off, we should step outside because it smells real bad in here. And then second... Oh, uh, let's see. I just met with Meister Horst. He was asking for some Berg medicine, Meister? But... I've gone to every shop, and I can't find it anywhere. So I thought you might know something. You know, you're kind of an alchemist, right? Kind of? That's why I'm asking. I'm not kind of one. Oh. But Berg medicine, huh? I've never tried making that. I saw Grandma making it before, so I should be able to make it too. Cool. It's a request I decided to accept. You don't have to force yourself if it'll be difficult. Mm -hmm. No, it's fine. I can't just ignore someone in need. Leave it all to me. Yeah. Oh, but I'm still not confident about it, so I should look for Grandma's book. Okay. Where's Graham Graham's book? It's probably right there on the table. Is that it? Uh, event, important events. Oh, ooh, something happened. Oh, cool. So we have the control scheme pop up at the bottom. I like that. I am using a PlayStation 4 controller, sort of. Hmm. I can't find it. Wait. What's this book? Is the secret of all alchemy. Ooh, a lot of What's tabs. Wrong? It's just that there's a book here that I don't recognize. Huh. It has a very elegant binding. I wonder what's inside. Words. Let's take a look. Sorry, sorry. Maybe pictures. I see. I see. Ah, this is a reference book for alchemy, but only the beginning is. The rest of it is all blank pages. Maybe Grandma was writing it. Interesting. Hmm. I see. Yeah. Anyway, Monica, after looking at this, I suddenly remembered. Uh... Huh? Remembered what? How to make the Berg medicine. The thing you were asking about. Cool. Really? You think you can make it? Of course. I have enough materials so I can mix it up real quick now. Sweet. Yes, please do so. Just be careful not to make another mistake, okay? I'll be fine. Just leave it to me. She's got my optimism. <laughs> I'll be fine, and then it never goes well. Uh, you can synthesize items by accessing the alchemy cauldron. All right. Accessing this desk allows you to save and load the game. And you can set the time to whenever you like by sleeping in the bed. If you return to the at atelier, or whatever they call it, the atelier late at night, you will automatically rest until morning. Hey, you know, honestly, I should just go with whatever they're saying because, I mean, they are the voice actors, actresses that actually were paid to do the job and with the voicing and the talking. And so their pronunciation is probably law. I mean, it, they had to get signed off on, right? I would assume. So it's probably whatever it was that she said. Anyway, Berg Medicine. Uh, important events to help out Monica 2 added. So, okay, so we got photo mode. If we hit the left analog stick in, we can actually zoom in. We can zoom out. I don't know how I zoomed in. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, the camera is really slow to turn. We can zoom real far out. We can zoom in. Can't zoom any closer than that. There's filter settings. Oh, high satch. Oh, that's really cool. High saturation, high contrast, enhanced blue, green, red, pastel colors, sharpen. Interesting. So, again, this is one of the modes I, I mean, normally I, I don't generally play around with stuff like this. 
it's cool that it exists and that's there. I mean, I'm totally down with that. But at the same time, it's not, oh, oh that's that's rough. Uh, at the same time, it's not really something that I personally enjoy. But I figured I'd show it off since we're here. Okay, we can frame it as a photograph, so on and so forth. Okay, ooh, that's kind of neat. The, the, the little, um, uh, are the uni slimes? I don't I remember what the slimes are. That's the Sophie, that's cool. Uh, morning, noon, evening, night. Oh, that's kind of cool. NPC, enemy, on or off. Oh, so if you're just in an area and you don't want to see enemy. Oh, that's cool. So they, they did, um, oh, that's, that's a, that's a thing. Okay. They did a, a pretty good job, actually, making this work. Movement speed. Oh, God. So slow or, like, incredibly hyper fast. All right, that's cool. All right, anyway. Ah, uh, yeah, we're going to end photo mode. Uh, we are going to end photo mode. So, cool stuff. Uh, we can run with the right trigger, which is cool. We can talk to our friend there. I assume she's our friend and Monica here. We don't know. All right, let's get in here. Let's see All if we right. can't synthesize Time something. To try making it. <laughs> Good luck, Sophie. Thank Leave you. It Leave it to me. Okay. What should I make? To synthesize items, you first select one of the recipes that you have learned. Synthesize uh, requires you to have the designated items. You can check which recipes you can make by looking at the circle square X symbols on the left. Circle can synthesize now. Trying did I say square? Triangle <laughs> can synthesize after making materials. X not enough. I think I said square. It's fine. I, I don't know what a triangle is. You uh, use this key as a quick reference to see which recipes you can make. All right, that's cool. All right, we got the circle. It means we can do it. Let's what do it. What materials should I use? After choosing the recipe, you will select the materials. Some materials require... Uh, material requirements are specific, but they can also be categories of items like water. Interesting. When a category is designated, you can freely select any item you want from that category. However, each item also has a different category value that represents its affinity with the category. The category value is displayed in the item's icon lower right. Uh, okay, 10, sure. Uh, the number's color represents the item's color. You can press the X button to swap the information, the item information to check the item's categories and category values all at once. So a lot of information was thrown at me, but okay. I mean, we don't have a lot of different options. This one has inflict sleep, but I mean, we probably don't need to use that. So, if we change the page, it's plant and it's medicine material. Okay. Pressing A will select an item. To select an item, we'll place a check mark over the selected item. Okay. Uh, the window on the right displays quality, effect, value, size, and use count. Sure. Size, huh? That's interesting. Quality, average quality of selected materials. Degraded. All right, that's fair. Effect value, total value of materials. Effect value, use count five. Is that effect value? And size, the average size of selected materials. Use count can increase up to three times as size grows to certain points. So I, I guess I want to do another one. Okay, and now we're on to the bird thing. Worthless feathers, and then we have a bunch of well water, and then we also have kirchen milk, which does not seem to be as bad. I guess it doesn't fit the category as well, because it's not necessarily water. It's an ingredient, and it is sort of water. Interesting. This is a... So this is a C, this is a C. It's average quality, this is impure quality. Okay. Sorry guys and guys, I am trying to also learn what I'm doing as we go. Is this really okay? I hope so, because we're gonna synthesize. Let's do it. Alright, I'll finish it now. Oh, and it takes time to synthesize, okay. Dad. Berg medicine, we made one. Yeah. Okay, HP recovery XS, extra small, I can only assume, change base, okay, medicine, and it's equipable. Okay, cool, that all makes sense. And we've unlocked the Berg medicine as a thing. Okay, got it. All right, done. Monica, it's ready. Yeah. Mm, that's amazing. It really is Berg medicine. Cool. Thank you, Sophie. You really helped me out. I aims to please. Don't worry about it. We're friends, right? <laughs> right. Anyway, 
I'll take this over to Meister Horse now. Maybe it's um, maybe in this case instead of Mister, and they're saying Meister. Maybe it was spelled out in the script. Not sure. Hey, Monica, it all works though. Do you mind if I go along? Ooh. Huh? I don't mind, but why? Let's see if he turns I'm into the a one toad. Who made this medicine. If it turned out to be no good, it would mean trouble. It's hmm. fair. I think it's fine, but well, it couldn't hurt. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, just a minute. I should write the recipe into the reference book while it's still fresh in my mind. There you go. Whoa, that was a big old quill. See that thing? That was a huge Sorry pen. Sorry for the wait, Monica. Anyway, let's go see Meister Horst. Let's go see Meister Horst. Oh gosh, it's a magical book of glowing magic. I, I got nothing. All right. Just waddling on down the street, you know, like we do. Meister Horst! Sup? What's going on? Oh, this guy. Look at him. Look at him. It's Horst. Horst Bassler. Ah, you two. Do you need anything? Meister Horst, I brought the Berg medicine you requested. Ta-da! Oh, thank you very much for bringing it so quickly, Monica. Well, actually, Sophie made it. I couldn't find any Berg medicine myself. Sophie, you made this? Yeah. Surprise. Yes. Um, is there something wrong with it? Not at all. In fact, it's quite rare to see Berg medicine as fine as this. I'm kind of a big deal. It seems your skills with alchemy are improving quite a bit, Sophie. Thank you. <laughs> you two have been very helpful. Here's your payment. Ooh. Cash monies. What? Wow, thank you so much, Meister Horse. Um, I didn't really do anything. I can't accept this. No, no. I'm the one who made such a sudden request. Think of it as a payment for your time. I insist. Aw, that's sweet. Very well. I'll accept it gratefully. Cool. Thank you too, Sophie. If you are ever troubled by anything, just ask. I'll do whatever I can to help. We're going to beat up a bunch of monsters. Come, help me. Anyway, we need to fight. I'll get going now. Have a good day, Meister Horst. Sophie. Bye. Yes, have a good day. Thank you. Cool. So our first uh, synthesization, that's totally a word, I was a success, and I'm, I'm here for it. I worked hard today. Huh? Where'd our book go? Oh, it's possessed. What? Surprise. You just got home, oh. and you're already so loud. Why is it talking? It's a talking floating book. Okay. Oh, sorry. Wait, what? Did the book just talk? Yes, I talked. What? The book... The book is talking? Please just calm down. Uh. People are able to talk. It's not strange for a book to talk, too. It's pretty, it's pretty strange for a book to talk. Though Audible is a thing, so maybe not. Huh? Um... I don't think that's how it works. She has a point. Um, so you're that reference book from earlier, right? The one I wrote in? Yes, I'm Plakta. Pl Plakta? I wouldn't have gone, I would have been Plachta, but Plakta, huh? Okay. It's flapping. Plakta, okay. Oh, you have a name. I'm Sophie. Sophie? I shall remember that. Write it down. Oh, wait. Um, Miss Plakta? Just call me Plakta. Uh, okay. Um, Plakta? What exactly are you? A book. Please say a book. Please a say a book. Yes! I can see I that. I love but it. You're a book. Yet you're flying and talking. It's really strange. A little bit it's odd. It's true that I'm different from an ordinary book. That's because I. I. That's strange. I can't remember. Aw. What exactly am I? Superbook. Um, that's what I want to know. Wait, Plakta, do you not have any memories? It seems so. I can remember that I'm related to alchemy, though. Cool. Alchemy? Then I might be able to help. I'm actually an alchemist. <sighs> yes, I know. A novice alchemist who doesn't even know how to produce Berg medicine. Oh, what? I just did it. What do you mean? Oh, Oh, you saw that. But I can make it now. 
Even a child could make that if they studied a little bit. But thanks. Just just bury me completely, why don't you? Uh, but, but Meister Horse praised me for it, saying it was really well made. From my point of view, it didn't appear particularly excellent in any way. Yay. Yeah, I'm terrible at alchemy. I make lots of mistakes, and I can't make lots of things. I can't help the people around town like my grandma was able to. That sucks. Do you wish to become better? Yes. Huh? I'm asking you if you wish to become better at alchemy. Of course I do. I would if I could. There is a device called the Cauldron of Knowledge. Ooh. It allows anyone to use the power of alchemy. Well, that seems like cheating. With that, you would be able to make free use of alchemy, as you so desire. But I want to learn an how. an amazing device like that? I want it! Where can I find it? The Cauldron of Knowledge is... Oh, this is strange. Is it? Oh no, don't tell me. Plakta, you forgot where the cauldron is? It seems so. Awkward! What? Are you serious? That's terrible! You got my hopes up <laughs> only to crush them. Against the jagged teeth of reality. I, I know it well. I am very sorry, but I can't remember it all. It's all good. As compensation, I can teach you alchemy myself. I'll take it. I may have lost my memories, but... I'm confident that my knowledge of alchemy exceeds yours. Well, I mean, that's not saying much, apparently. Hmm, you do seem pretty smart. It, it is you a talking book. You do know more about alchemy than me. If you'll teach me, I'll gladly accept. I will gladly accept that you accept gladly. Okay. Very well. We'll be working together starting now, Sophie. Excellent. Yeah! I look forward to it, Plakta. All right. Ooh, intro thing. Okay, enjoy, guys. We got the story so far. We have a plot. We have a plan. We have a goal, and we're, I guess, pretty much ready to get started and get moving okay. here. Okay, let's not waste any time. Can you teach me some stuff, Pakta? Probably. You're quite enthusiastic. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to be a novice forever. <laughs> Very well. Try synthesizing something first. I just did. Synthesis? I can do that. All right. I want us to synthesize some more let's stuffs. See materials oh what's wrong ain't got nothing i used all my materials when i made that bird medicine i have nothing left then it seems you need to gather some is there a place nearby where you can do that yeah i know of a place but Huni appear there so i'm scared to go alone oh right i can have monica come with me yeah there you go monica is that the girl who was with you yesterday yeah, she's actually really strong. I see. Then you should be safe. Very well, please be careful. Okay. Huh? You're not coming too? I'm a floating, flying, talking book. Probably not a good plan. As you can see, even if I was to go, I wouldn't be able to fight. Seeing how I'm a book and all. Yeah. Oh, that's right. <laughs> okay, how did, I'll be off then. How did you forget that? Like, How is that yes, a thing that you forgot? Try to come back quickly. 
Time is finite. Time, I, time is finite. It, it's very true. If you take too long, I won't have as much time to teach you alchemy. Oh. <laughs> You're right. Okay, I'll try to hurry back. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, unfortunately, we're going to break off this episode here, but uh, I think what I'm going to end up doing is I'll probably do two, maybe three episodes of each of the games uh, consecutive days, so today, tomorrow, the next day. That way you guys have kind of a, a rough idea of what each game has to offer, how they play, you get to see the storyline, you get to see a little bit of how the synthesis and all that stuff works, and hopefully we get into a little bit of the combat so you can see some of the gameplay mechanics and all that stuff happening anyway a big shout out and a thank you once again to koei tecmo for hooking me up with this trilogy i just didn't get a lot of time to do it so we'll see we'll see what i can do i may be insane by the end of it it's it's on wednesday my busiest day of the week as well so it's like oh no it's okay i'm happy i'm excited i'm eager if you guys happen to enjoy this you want to find out more information about the game where to get the game information on the developer or any of that stuff will be down below in the description of the video and various links I'll try to include the Switch, the PS4, and the Steam links for you guys. That way you can just grab it from whatever place you want to and it makes it a little bit easier. I'll also include the Trilogy as like an entire deluxe pack and the individual game. There's, there's going to be a lot of stuff down there, so just dig through it, figure out what you want to grab if you're going to grab the games and do it. If you guys happen to enjoy this video, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Any kind of engagement, if you guys want to leave a comment, tell me your thoughts on the series as a whole, of what you've seen from me playing thus far. Or if you're a veteran of the series, uh, if you're excited to see someone kind of dive in fresh and new. And let me know your thoughts on the DX version of this releasing, the deluxe pack and all that stuff. All right, folks, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show. Always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer.